Rhenium is a fascinating element with a rich history, significant contributions from notable scientists, and widespread industrial applications. In this video, we will explore the history of Rhenium, the scientists behind its discovery and understanding, and the various industries where it is used. Before starting the video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more engaging videos like this. Rhenium was discovered in 1925 by German chemists Ida Nodak, Walter Nodak, and Otto Berg. They detected it in platinum ore and named it after the Rhine River. It took several years to isolate pure rhenium due to its rarity and the complex process required for extraction. Rhenium is a silvery white, dense metal with one of the highest melting points of all elements, at about 3,180 degrees Celsius. It is also resistant to corrosion and has excellent mechanical properties. Ida Nodak, a pioneering female chemist, Ida Nodak co-discovered rhenium and made significant contributions to the field of chemistry. Walter Nodak, along with his wife Ida, Walter Nodak played a crucial role in identifying rhenium and studying its properties. Otto Berg, another key figure in the discovery of rhenium, Otto Berg worked alongside the Nodaks in the early exploration of this element. Industries where rhenium is used Aerospace Rhenium is a crucial component in aerospace applications due to its exceptional properties. It is often used in superalloys for jet engine components, such as turbine blades, nozzles, and combustion chambers. Rhenium's high melting point, 3180 degrees Celsius, and excellent heat resistance make it ideal for withstanding the extreme temperatures and harsh conditions experienced in jet engines. This helps improve engine efficiency, reliability, and performance, contributing to safer and more efficient air travel. Catalysis Rhenium-based catalysts play a vital role in various chemical processes, particularly in petroleum refining and the production of fine chemicals. These catalysts help facilitate reactions such as hydrocracking, hydrotreating, and catalytic reforming, which are essential for converting crude oil into valuable products like gasoline, diesel, and petrochemicals. Rhenium's unique properties, such as its ability to promote desired reactions and withstand high temperatures, make it highly effective in catalytic applications. Electronics In the electronics industry, rhenium is used primarily in the manufacture of electrical contacts. These contacts are crucial components in electronic devices like switches, connectors, and relays. Rhenium's resistance to wear, corrosion, and high temperatures ensures reliable electrical performance over time, making it suitable for demanding applications in aerospace, telecommunications, automotive, and other industries. Medical Imaging Rhenium-188, a radioactive isotope of rhenium, is used in nuclear medicine for diagnostic imaging and cancer therapy. It emits beta radiation, which can penetrate tissues and is used in treatments like radiotherapy for certain types of cancer. Rhenium-188 is also used in diagnostic procedures, such as bone scans and tumor imaging, contributing to the early detection and treatment of medical conditions. X-ray tubes. Rhenium alloys are utilized in X-ray tubes due to their high melting point and ability to withstand extreme temperatures generated during X-ray production. These alloys help produce precise and consistent X-ray beams, essential for medical diagnostics, industrial testing, and scientific research. Rhenium-based materials are crucial in ensuring the accuracy and quality of X-ray imaging systems. Thermocouples Rhenium is a key component of thermocouples used for measuring high temperatures in industrial processes like steel manufacturing, aerospace testing, and power generation. Thermocouples operate based on the Seebeck effect, where the voltage produced is proportional to the temperature difference between the junctions. Rhenium's high melting point and stability at elevated temperatures make it suitable for thermocouple applications, requiring precise and reliable temperature measurements. If you found this video informative, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more engaging videos like this.